Presidency School of Engineering and Presidency School of Computer Science and Engineering are hosting the fifth innovative project expo in the university campus. Here at the expo, the students have showcased their work. So right from software solutions to hardware innovations, it's all about applying technology to solve real world problems. Let's see what all is being showcased at the expo. projects to tell us about this innovative expo which is happening at Presidency University campus. Welcome to this YouTube video ma'am. Uh, every year Presidency University organizes this expo. Please tell us something about it. Yeah, so our university is rich in uh, establishing an innovation ecosystem for the first year student research. As soon as they enter the campus, they are learning with many practical hands-on as well as uh, they have are exposed to two innovative courses, innovative projects using Arduino and innovative project using the Raspberry Pi. Mm -hmm. So in order to give them a practical hands-on uh, training as well as uh, and to address many societal and industry relevant project at the freshman itself. So uh, basically the concept is like this, uh, the students has to create a group of uh, multidisciplinary teams of six members and then they have to work with the problem statement. The problem statement will, will be purely on uh, the societal relevant as well as uh, industry, what industry read, need actually. So uh, this is where we will be taking them will be exposing them to uh, the real world uh, you know challenges uh, and then how to solve to uh, identify the solution best solution for the potential challenges so we have a support system like student mentors also will be allotted and then uh, the faculty mentors will also be guiding them in order to come out with the uh, solution best solution so every year the project course will be concluded uh, with the innovative project uh, uh, expo mm -hmm. so where top 70 projects will be identified among top 500 uh, students uh, uh, that is 500 project teams. Every semester we will have around 500 project teams and out of this so we are scrutinizing to top 70. Among top 70 today we have our industry panelists come from IBM, come from TCS and then uh, you know uh, many other chipware companies. So they will be assessing the students of top 70 and then bringing them to top 10 as well as the best societal as well as best industrial relevant projects will be identified. Thank you for speaking to us ma'am. Thank you, Thank you ma'am. For the budding engineers, this expo is an excellent platform to showcase their work. Let's ask them about their experience. How has the innovative expo been for you and uh, what have you displayed here at the expo? Uh, good morning, first of all. Uh, we have, uh, first of all, the innovative expo is about uh, implementation of students' ideas uh, for the social so society and all. And our project is about uh, automatic switching of grid power into solar power. We have used renewable energy for our uh, uh, project, that is the solar energy. Uh, now, uh, that also we have implemented with the government. So, government has implemented about some uh, uh, power bill, power cutoff. So, that 200 units uh, power bill, we have to use it less. We have to store the grid power. So, we, we have implemented solar energy. After using some units of uh, grid power, our project, uh, it will shift to the solar energy that will be stored in the battery. So this uh, stores the this saves the grid power also grid energy also and we can will be using the solar energy for uh, society and even it can be implemented for uh, many purposes household things companies everywhere it, it can be used. The idea is very great. We get proper hands-on experience on like with the devices that we normally don't get in classes. If we go to labs, we get, but then in classes, in theory, we actually get to implement these. We get to learn a lot about the ideas. Thank you for joining us at the 5th Innovative Project Expo, where ideas ignite and innovations take flight. See you in the next video.